Hello everybody, welcome back. So today we are making these chocolate strawberry popsicles. So for those of you who saw la no So for those of you guys who saw Tuesday's video, the fact that we're making popsicles today means that the bubble tea kit hasn't arrived yet, but it's going to be arriving next week. So make sure to stay tuned for next week where I'll be making bubble tea. Anyways, at this morning I was like stressing out and I'm like, what am I going to make? It's Thursday and I have like no recipe planned. But I actually had this recipe in mind for like about a year or so. And I've always wanted to make it because I thought it would look and taste so good, but I've never gotten around to it. So I'm really, really happy that I got around to it today. So these are popsicles and the base of the popsicle is made out of strawberries and milk and strawberry yogurt and it just tastes so good and so creamy and delicious and then it is topped with a hard set like chocolate shell which is basically a chocolate sauce that when you pour it over something cold it hardens immediately and it creates this like beautiful little like drippy pattern and I think it's so pretty and these taste exactly like chocolate strawberries and I think they're kind of like a little like glammed up version of regular popsicles so yeah let's get started Okay, so first you want to place the chopped strawberries, some strawberry yogurt, milk and vanilla extract in a blender and pulse until smooth. Then stick some sliced strawberries into the inside of your popsicle mold and then pour the popsicle mixture into the molds. Insert popsicle sticks and freeze these until they're solid for about three or four hours. Then to make the chocolate coating, just combine some chocolate chips and some coconut oil and microwave them at 30 second intervals until everything is fully melted. Unmold the popsicles by running the molds under hot water for about 5 to 10 seconds and then dip the popsicles into the chocolate coating and then turn them upright to create a drip pattern and you are done! So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like this recipe. If you try these popsicles out, definitely send me a photo on Instagram or Twitter or anywhere. And ignore the sweater, it's raining today. I know the sweater doesn't really go with popsicles, but it's raining outside, so I wanted something cozy. Anyways, yes, I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. And make sure to stay tuned for next week's bubble tea video. And I'm doing a big back to school giveaway where two people will win lots of things, lots of pretty things. Um, check out my Snapchat if you'd like to see a little hint because I'm gonna be showing you guys what some of the little prizes are tonight. But yeah, I love you guys so much and have a fantastic weekend. Bye.